Hi loves and welcome to today's video. For today I'm doing a cute pink devil Halloween makeup look. I'm starting by using pink face paint. This is from Snazaru. I'm using in hot pink and pale pink and I'm mixing both because I didn't want a super hot pink so I'm kind of creating a more like baby pink and applying it all over my face. I'm using the Huda Beauty Coconut Glow Mist to activate the paint because it makes it less drying because face paints tend to get like super drying so I'm using uh, the glow mist you can use any mist you have at home to make it less drying and it works really well for me It makes the face paint apply really smoothly. So I'm applying this uh, Face paint all over my face and also on my neck So you want to apply the color where your body is exposed. So uh, if you use a top like me you want to apply it like on your chest and I'm using a flat brush to apply the paint but you can also use a beauty blender now I'm going in with a little bit of white paint and I'm just like applying that to highlight my face just where I usually apply like concealer so you're basically gonna highlight and contour just using like shades that complement the pink so going with a lighter pink and a darker pink to highlight but I like using white because it, it blends really well with the pink and it looks like a super light pink. I'm using a wet beauty blender to blend everything together and then I'm using the back of the beauty blender with a little bit of that hot pink face paint to contour and then I just go back and forth and blend everything together until you are happy with how everything is looking. Now the next thing I'm doing is going into the James Charles uh, palette with Morphe and you Using that hot pink shade and a angled brush, I'm just like setting the face paint and contouring my face with that hot pink. And uh, you can use any rainbow palette you have, uh, even if it's drugstore or high end, just use a hot pink shade. And you can do this look with any color you want. You can do a blue devil, purple devil, it's up to you. So here I'm using the white shade from that same palette to highlight and set that uh, paint under my eyes. And I'm just using a fluffy large brush to blend everything together. Next, I'm going in with the Be Perfect Cosmetics Carnival Palette 3 and I'm using a burgundy pinkish shade to even shade and contour uh, my face a little bit more and uh, it looks more like dimensional, it's like bronzing, it gives you a more snatched kind of look so I'm going in with a little bit of a darker shade uh, on my forehead, on my jawline, where I usually contour and bronze. Now to make the look look less dry, I'm going in with the Glow Coco from uh, Huda Beauty and spraying a lot of it on my face. And the next thing we are going to do is highlighting and I'm using the Dream Glow Kit from ABH. I love this one so much. I'm using a combination of all the shades and just apply that on my cheekbones, my forehead, my chin and really make it super glowy. I think it gives such a pretty like touch to this look. Next thing we have brow. So I'm using the Real Lipstick and this is from ABH and I'm just using it just like how I use a brow pomade with an angled brush, like brow brush and uh, shading it just like how I would do with a brow pomade and I wanted to fill in the dark gaps so I went with a little bit of a dark uh, brow pencil and fill in those gaps. Now I'm just prepping my lids for the eyeshadow now using a hot pink shade from the Be Perfect Cosmetics palette, I'm basically contouring my eyes uh, to give the look more dimension. You just want to apply that shade and blend it really well. It can be a little bit hard to blend the shades uh, on your eyes, but you just need to go back and forth. Then on here I'm using a eyeliner pen from e.l.f. Cosmetics. I love it so much, it's so precise, super easy to use and super affordable. It's so black as well, so I'm doing a super thick black 
uh, winged liner. Uh, I think it looks so great on this look. So you just want to do a really thick line. But you can do any eye look you want. I just feel like this with the black lip looks really well. Then I'm using Tati Lashes TL9. I apply them off camera and I'm using the same highlighter, the Glow Kit from ABH in Dream to highlight my tear duct and my brow bones. Next thing is these cute little moon and star stencils. They are from La Rimmel London and they are really affordable. I'm just placing some like stars and moons under my eyes. And now it's time for a lipstick. I'm using the Dead of Night, I'm I'm not sure if that's the name but I think so, uh, from Kylie Cosmetics. And here it looks kind of grey because I had lip balm underneath. But I'm just like lining my lips and then going over with the liquid lipstick and it looks so well together with the eyeliner. But with this look you can be as creative as you want, you can give it more details or you can just keep it simple. Uh, I applied a little bit of gloss, I think it looks so great like that. And I'm just giving it some final touches and the look is done you guys, this is so simple, so easy of course, a wig. But this is such a simple look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And happy Halloween, you guys. I see you on my next one. Bye-bye.